countries or communities try to control, adapt, and manage the new nemesis, and that is the COVID-19. In this time, we also have with us the Delta variant. And for today, I want to show you something that my county that I live in, right, uh, they're trying to do or control this Delta variant. And for today, we're going to, you know, you know, be on the road with four wheels and not always two wheels because it's still motor vlogging. So you know what? Stay tuned, stay right there, and welcome to Josh Connect. And my name is Josh. If today it's your first time on this channel, do me a favor, go down there and subscribe. So we're gonna show you some of the things that they do to counter the the, the spread of the of the Delta variant, uh, more or less the 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 general. Um, pandemic you know it's, it's it's crazy everywhere and it's like the reemergence of the COVID-19 in some cities here um, in my city it's not that bad uh, being Guizhou province it's uh, the southwestern part of China uh, for those of you you might have heard about Guangzhou yeah it's called Guangzhou not Guangzhou yeah, many people go ahead and say Guangzhou, Guangzhou. It is Guangzhou. Um, most of Chinese cities got these um, suffix, right? They got the suffixes. Uh, that is the Z H O U, Z H O U. So you can have the Suzhou, Nanzhou, Guizhou, Hangzhou, and Guangzhou. You know the Zhou, 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 Zhou. Right. So. <clears throat> More or less in English, it might sound like zoo, but not zoo, it is zo guanzo. <laughs> anyway, enough of the lecturing on Chinese. And so, um, I just want you guys to see how the Chinese try to more or less uh, slow down or try to prevent the spread of the new variant so i was going on this stretch of road which it links up with other counties all right and um, you could also connect using this link road to other regions and so in the middle somewhere uh they have um not a security barrier but kind of you no know, sprinklers that will sprinkle some kind of water onto your car and uh, more or less disinfecting i don't know the name of that but uh, when we get there uh, please if you know the name you can leave a comment right down and we're in traffic so it's safe you know you know you got to put your eyes on the road you know what i mean yeah if a lot of counties or governmental agencies that are in charge of uh you know epidemics pandemic like the epidemiology department whatever i don't know if they could take a look at this i think it's pretty cool and so all cars should go through you know yeah all cars should go through because some of the cars that are coming into the city are from other counties all right and so you get there you scan your QR code and after that the car goes through you know um it just it just literally goes through that like a washing bay <laughs> should i call it a washing bay disinfectant <laughs> i don't know but it's some kind of a station right so if you have any comments you have any question please let me know drop it down the comment section and uh we'll try and learn together this is the learning phase of josh connect motor vlog all right we have a lot of programs lined up right coming from the southwestern part of china for you i know we're gonna try and feed your curiosity uh today traffic is a little bit uh you know tight yeah it is around 3 34 so we just gotta go with the flow
place we just went with the flow. And you know what? We're still right here with you. This is Josh Connect. If you just joined us or if you just are watching this video. And my name is Josh and this is Josh Motor Vlog. We come your way every Tuesday. Now, as we are on the road, we'd like to share um, a couple of, you know, uh, useful info for you. You know, I, I'm, I'm, I'm not an expert, but, you know, just helping, just trying to share what uh, we've seen, we've known, or, you know, I believe that the, the entry point to cities and countries should be well observed. Um, the predominant COVID-19 strain has put the focus back on prevention. Prevention, I believe, is the key. Hence, this video that um, I'm sharing with, with y'all. I, I think that a well-rehearsed and effective management protocols should be put in place. This newer strain of COVID-19, it's crazier than you might think. Trust me. It, it is highly contagious. It, it's, its symptoms are just the same as its brother, COVID-19, you know? And... It does affect unvaccinated people more. And let me take it again. It does affect unvaccinated people a lot. Check out my video on my third uh, vaccine shot that I had. Okay, When we started here, um, uh, we had three shots. Yeah, three shots. I took the first, the second, and I just finished the third protocol all right so at least i am a little bit protected i wouldn't have to be rushed to the trauma center you know so um let's hit on this let this get in real fast you know let's throw away all conspiracy theories or or mystical things out of the window you guys we we're right here and that is what i'm trying to show as you can see as we're approaching uh we're approaching um a sort of barrier or a check where cars have to go through you could see their uh sprinkler or the sprinklers uh um right in the middle of the road um, you know spraying some disinfectant and onto the cars yes that's, that's something or good in or in the name of you know preventive measures i, I believe that it is something that um it's 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 worth sharing yeah in my own candid opinion though what do you think right i mean it's pretty cool like cars taking a mini shower you know <laughs> yeah and uh, because these these cars are coming from um different link roads and and going out of the county all right so more or less preventing um, these COVID-19 variants from either leaving the county or getting to the county one way or the other. So I, I believe that's something that we should take a second look at it, right? Uh, what do you think? Uh, what are your thoughts? Uh, you could leave a comment down and share some of them with us here. Mm -hmm.